Hey guys, this is Dirk. Welcome back to some more Hand of Fate. There is nothing um, left but your final challenge. So we're going to the final challenge now. Let's see. Is, is he just talking about endless mode? No, there is a thing up there. The dealer. Let's do it. Dealer's curse player receives a curse at each new dungeon level. Damn. And excommunication player cannot receive any more blessings. So we get zero blessings. And we get a curse at each new dungeon level. Seriously? Um, there are two different challenges. Six Call of the Shadows and six Devilish Traps. Um, Alright, let's do it. Now for the ultimate prize. Uh, I no, offer let's no do this. Mercy. We'll add Blood Crescent. I'm pretty sure there was something else. Um... There's a couple new things actually. Guildmaster's ring and the master ring and the ring of peace. Let's get rid of ring of gluttony and what plunderer's ring do? With every game card player receives plus one gold and plus two health. Okay, we can get rid of that one. Um, let's check the encounters deck. We'll get soldiers on leave, dark crystal, and the lonely bard. All right, so there we go. Let's do it. Let's face the dealer. You face me. The rules change yet again. And that deck looks huge compared to uh, the previous ones. That's a lot of cards there. Alright, negative aura. Whenever the player loses a curse, they also lose one random item. Away from bad luck. Uh, call for the priest. You are so close to victory and I guardian so angel. The final nothingness. I have fought against this day for so long. But we, we can't keep guardian angel, unfortunately. We got angel's wing. Helm imbues wear with greater movement speed. That'll be nice. Um, unfortunately, we can't keep our guardian angel blessing because of his damn curse. Um, so set up. Let's get 15 gold. We got loans, so we can actually give it to him. Let's give him 10 gold. We get the gold payback. Many of these blessings to the right. Are too good we get 15 more gold. Secret society food. Let's go get food wagon. Um. We play for a token Can we now. do this? No. Food wagon. Let's call an offer help. Um, we get one food game card, seven food, hell yeah. Let's head back up and do the cave mouth. Um, let's exit the cave. Compensation. Whenever the player the finishes the combat, go. they lose the one gold per 15 health. Become. Do you believe the oh, I never checked the uh, starting equipment. Returns us to the world in order to experience afresh all that has happened. I do. Okay, so this time we Get start with a fine blade, which um yeah, it looks life. better, but it's the exact same thing as the rusty axe. The uh, we get ring of hindsight. Oops, wrong wrong button. Um, like I said, we get ring of hindsight. Um, reveals all encounter cards upon reaching the next stairs. Merchant Strain, Killing Streak. Every kill earns the player a stackable speed and damage boost. Taking aim at any damage resets the boost to nil. Okay, so that's awesome. Um, no gloves, just that fine blade. Medium armor, um, compensation and negative aura. Excommunication, Dealer's Curse. Angel's Wing, and a regular shield. Okay, so we have 15 gold. We got the Maiden here. We can't get blessings because of the uh, damn thing. Let's ask for supplies. Let's get two food game cards. There's five food, and there's one food. Right, let's head down. There we go. We get the river, devilish traps, and soldiers on leave. We're going to ignore all three of those. Sail okay, so let's board the ship. Uh, 
uh, infected ring. Spawn entering a new area, the player takes 5 damage for every ring in their possession. So that's what, 15 damage for us? It takes a very special person to walk through this door. You need to have lived a life that provides enough meat for our deck. Yet, okay, so let's enough will to walk approach it. Let's, yeah, let's just buy a ton of food. Left to persist. Okay. Um, I don't think we can remove any curses. If we do, we lose uh, an item. This is the one I'd like to get rid of, but that ain't gonna happen. Um, so let's buy food. We can buy that, and then that, and then this. I'm sure you're grateful for that. So that nine. I wasn't really paying attention. I think it was nine. So let's head to the right. Get 15 gold out of that in the old graveyard, which is uh, the rest of the spirits sense the presence of a cursed soul. Oh damn. That's new. Lose 5 max health. And lose 15 max health. How unpleasant. Yeah, tell me about it. Uh, Bandit attacks summon the lonely bard, holy forge, and devilish traps. Damn. I was hoping to, uh, to get, um, that awesome weapon. But it ain't gonna happen, so let's just go, go on to the next area. Get the exit portal. Between worlds. A thing that cannot be. Weak yes. wrist performing a prone finisher inflicts five damage on the player. Um, so there's that I guy. Have made my wager. Noble I trader. My deal. You have questions, and I will provide um, answers. Wandering minstrels. After all, that is why you came here, is it or not? Let's ask for information. Um, angry guildmaster, ratman hunting, Emberton hero. Looks like we're finally gonna hit up the devilish trap. Um, okay, so we finally get the token from that one. It appears they were after gold. Um, so let's head down and over. Ember Town Hero. Let's ask my troubles. Let's do it. Traveling Tinker. Um, we should be able to buy a little bit of food, I imagine. Um, let's see. So let's skip that. Um, is there, do we have anything we can sell? We can sell some... Did we already sell a ring? I guess we could sell Merchant's Ring, but I want to keep this one for sure. Um, let's keep it. It gives me kind of a, a a decent view of what's to come. It helps me kind of flesh out the floor in my in my head. Um, so we're gonna go left, do the Ember Town Hero, and probably Devilish Traps. I don't know if it affects it if Ember Town Hero's um, layered over top. And I was, I hate that it resets it. Like that makes no sense. You just move left. Why would you want to go to the right? So, um, let's refuse to deal. Draw one monster card. Two dust. This should be easily done. So. There we go. Finish them off. Moving at a pretty good pace there. Now, we lost six gold. Number on here, we have two game cards, ten gold per blessing, so we get nothing. And five food. Um, luckily, um, the devilish traps didn't affect us. Let's climb the ladder. Uh, what's this looking like? Parasite. Starving causes more damage. That's fine. Okay, so let's head the down path first, I guess. Devilish traps, damn. Imagination and illusion. Spells without weight and meaning. Yet, they can wrap you in ribbons as easily as any other. So, 
Uh, one night you awaken to find yourself enclosed in a maze of traps. Everything seems strangely familiar, like a nightmare from your childhood. A disembodied voice calls out seemingly from the sky. They say there are lessons to be learned from our dreams. Do you believe it? If so, the lesson here clearly is that life is unfair. The voice laughs and laughs, the sound receding away until only something to something something that it didn't let me read. I tried to read it, it wouldn't let me. So let's head to the right. And it doesn't give us a very good view. Ooh, oh, come on now. Come on now. That, that sucks. That really sucks. Is this way out? Okay, it looks like it is. Alright then. You wake the next morning wondering why you cannot shake the vision of a cat playing with a mouse and the sound of a laugh, cold and cruel. Sit down. The altar. Let's pray. Actually, let's not because nothing is going to happen. Um, like, we can't get a. Uh, we can't get anything out of it. Let's to the right. We got the tavern. Like everything we deal let's with help. Here, we do not merely speak of a tavern, but the archetypal ideal of a tavern. Still, if it's Huge not success. Nice. These places exist. Um, once exist. two game cards, five gold, and five food. Hell yeah! What are we looking at? More devilish traps. What traps can you contend with? So let's do it. Oh fuck a Christ! <laughs> Apparently you can't dodge through those very well. Whoa, holy shit. That was uh, a bit surprising. I was not prepared for that. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, come on now. didn't recognize that in time and we're back in that original room um, this is where we came Let's look this way this time and We passed it. I didn't even see the ladder here. So we passed. We ran right past it. God damn it. Okay. So, uh, devil's traps, blah, blah, blah. Got it done. Let's do it. Uh, traveling jeweler. Um, let's approach the shop. We got 44 gold. Let's check out the items real quick. Buy items. Guildmaster's ring. There's these plus one food whenever they enter a shop. That was tempting, but no. Uh, ring of peace. Whenever after any encounter in which the player did not enter into combat, the player receives plus one gold for every blessing. Uh, this one's nice. We're gonna take this. Three more. Inflicts three more damage for every curse they have. Yeah. Uh, so we'll definitely take that one, and we'll get three food out of it as well. And let's head out. The cult ring is going to be huge, I think. Um, I'm hoping that this is the way out. God damn it, Heroes Remains. Well, let's do it. Um, equip the really? Yeah. Is that what you're going to and do? Pain, yeah. Oh, heavy burden, that sucks. The black deck delivers again. There's one. Pass by. Two. Three. Four. Five. Seriously? 
It put it to a spot where I couldn't get there in time? Are you fucking kidding me? Well, we're already screwed, so... It already took all the damn hell. Let's accept the offer and take the gold. Why not? More than anything, I am proud of my array of curses. Hey, at least it puts it within range this time. Uh, Master Ring. What was this again? Thirsty's. Oh yeah, that's One right. Ring um, let's take the huge hammer. The rings. It is only regrettable that you have so few fingers. That'd be very nice. I guess we have forced escape. An expedition. Press on. Okay. Weak ankles. Players' run speed ah, is reduced by twenty-five percent. Seriously? Man, come as on, long man. As you play and persist, we will continue Fifteen gold. Rat man hunting. To a resolution. Two Mount monster cards. Queen of plague. Four of plague. Mind you, and none. Have succeeded. Oh crap. I forgot about that thing. Come on now. Let me dodge. Like, when I hit the dodge button, it'd be cool if it let me, you know, dodge. I hate fighting on that boat. You will never uh, face me. Yeah, I will. So it goes. Okay, so we did get one token out of that at least. Um, let's check it out. We're generously sharing so much gold with the wandering minstrels. We receive 25 health and the oracle. Um, not too bad. That's kind of. I I don't like the getting all the rat men on the boat like that. It seems kind of OP, especially when you consider the fact that you can't you can't do the dodge in there. Um, like it doesn't it doesn't work because when you dodge. Um, the enemies glide backwards with you if they're even remotely touching you they glide next to you and that's that ain't right to me um, I wish they'd fix that but um, yeah it is what it is but uh, that's it for today guys hope you enjoyed I am out I'm uh, probably gonna make some food I'm hungry see you guys then bye bye